Oh my goodness, are you guys seeing this? Well, of course, we're here at Snake Morphology. <laughs> what are we looking at here, brother? Once again, I'm addicted to the super pastel highways, I'm trying to do different combos. Um, I actually start putting in some banana inchi on the highways and some GHI on the highways. So this one's almost about gravity. Uh, on this one, we've been ultrasounding everything that's been coming through. Um, we got anywhere between 20 to 30 millimeter um, follicles on all, most of our females. So we're gonna have a really, really great year. Wow, doing big things here at Snake Morphology. So while we're looking at this beautiful super scent over here, why don't you go ahead and uh, tell us what's going down this weekend? So this weekend we'll be out in Bakersfield on the Reptile Show. It's a big pet expo in the convention center, and we'll be out there for the weekend. Um, we'll be out there with the final batch of baby animals that we got. We actually sold out this year, but um, we'll be stocking up about 700 babies for this breeding season. Um, and it's all going to be pretty high end. This is uh, Super Cinnamon, which is already being bred to... Uh, that was a female male I put this. So I got a, a blackhead, a blackhead um, champagne. So it's gonna be really nice. Yeah, it looks it's gorgeous. Really I, I noticed you have uh, some amazing new keeping cards here, right? Oh, yeah, we got a little label printer. So if, just to make it more neat, we um, start labeling everything, keeping everything really organized. Um, just breathing. The male, yeah, because he's not there. So, where do we put the male to breed? And there he is, locked up. The so, what I usually do is the way we breed, and this will be great for everybody else we, we put the male on one, then we have female, female, and if we need to continue with that male, we put female, 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 then we got male, female, female. So, I got these little clips that I keep it on the male. So, when the male's breeding with the female, the little tip follows the male, so I know exactly which male, the, which, where the male is breeding, which with which which female. That's amazing. That's a pretty yeah. good system. So, you just developed that here, huh? Yeah. So I have the male, female, female. So if that's breeding, we put the female up here, and then if the male, we switch the male over, it follows the male. So we know exactly what's breeding just by looking at it right away. And then we usually breed them about three, four days on each female, and then we give them a week rest. Um, we usually breed them the first season twice on that first month. Then we usually breed them just once a month every time after that. Um, you don't want to burn out your male. Sometimes when you're breeding five females to one male, you gotta be very careful. If you see your male getting way too skinny, you gotta stop because you're gonna really kill your male. He'll he'll breed, he'll stop eating to his death. Like every single male out there, you know, but we won't die. Um, but the snakes will. They'll breed until their death. They won't eat and they just you just kill them. So remember never overbreed your male. All they need to do is get hooked up one time a month, and she's, he's, she's good to go for the female. Don't kill him. If you get an ultrasound machine, uh, we picked this one pretty up cheap in eBay. I picked this one up like for 500 bucks. Um, we ultrasound, um, and then we exactly know where the follicles at. Say one of the females, it's at 35 millimeter eggs. You don't have to keep burning your male out. She's done. She's good to go. And it's pretty simple. All right, man. We really appreciate you taking some time, giving us some tips here. Definitely big shout out to snake morphology. Well, thank you Ed, for coming by once again picking up some some snake husk Oh, yeah, I'm gonna go head over right now and uh, drop some off to granddaddy herps as well So much nice. love everybody. We appreciate you. Take care. Thank you so much, and we'll see you on the next one be good. Take care guys